Hi, today I will show you how to use Review and Schema plugin. You will get three features. Let's see how to use this plugin. First, you need to install the plugin, navigate WordPress menu plugins, then click add new. Now search review and schema by radius theme. This is the plugin. Now we will click install now. After install the plugin, I will click activate. After activate the plugin, you will get the admin menu like this. First, we will check the settings menu. In settings tab, first tab is for review settings. We will set review related settings here like Google Recaptcha and other settings. Second tab for schema settings. First schema has some sub settings like organization info set the organization info fields here then social profiles you can set the social profiles multiple social profile here then corporate contacts you can set corporate contact information here search result you can enable side link search result also the main navigation from here then publisher info you can set the publisher name publisher logo here now last one is third party plugin sometimes default schema of WooCommerce yes to give some error so we can disable WooCommerce default schema easy digital download default schema yes to side link search box yes to default schema if we check this check box then all schema will generate from review schema plugin then WooCommerce settings these settings for schema markup brand name identifier type identifier value if you don't fill this value by default it will give error message in schema then media we will set media size and type from here now we will generate our first review and schema navigate review schema then click all review schema now click new review schema first we will give a title here like review and schema for post then select the post type we will select the post we will first generate the review and schema for wordpress default post type so i select the post type post then need to select the support type which type it will support review with schema only review only schema we will generate both review and schema so we will select the first one now we will set the other settings like review first one is criteria single or multi criteria let's select multi criteria then review summary layout then review layout then pagination type now settings tab we can set the 
fields from here you can allow image you can enable or disable review title allow google recaptcha allow filter let's allow the filter option now schema tab by default schema tab is disabled we can we need to enable this now we will select the schema data type as we select the post we can select the schema data type block posting for the post last one is style tab we can set the review box with margin padding color settings and other settings from here let's publish this now we will check the review and rating in content Let's post this is our review and rating fields let's fill the field now i will submit the review after submit the review it will be auto published okay our review is done now i will check the schema data for this post i will copy the url first i will test with this result url it will take few seconds okay our test is done the page is eligible for this result this is blog posting type as we said in this in the schema settings this is blog posting type okay everything is okay there is no error or warning now we will test in validator.schema.org okay there is no error or warning type blog posting so our schema data is okay for the post check our next video how to generate schema markup for pages thanks for watching our video if you face any issue please mail support at radiusteam.com we will help you as soon as possible